An LNP backbencher has broken ranks saying the government should repeal the civil union laws altogether. State political editor Cathy Border is at Parliament where there's been a lengthy party room meeting. Now Cathy, is Mr Newman's leadership being tested on this? It is, Bill. It was a week ago that the Cabinet made the decision that the civil union le legislation will stay, with only a minor amendment that the state sanctioned ceremonies would end. An LNP party room meeting has been held. It's only just broken up. A number of MPs wanted to have their say about it, and they're under increasing pressure from outside Cabinet uh, party ranks, I should say, to also do something about it. Another element in this story is that it was during the election campaign the LNP President Bruce McIver made it very clear it was party policy to dump this legislation altogether. Going into Cabinet this morning, Ministers were towing the line and standing by the decision to only partially change the civil union legislation. I'm sure that uh, it's something that uh, we can resolve. That's what we're meant to do, sort it out in party room and then come out as one. Well, the decision's been taken and I think it straddles the right balance that needs to be done. Oh, it's a fair and reasonable result for everybody concerned. We are moving through as Cabinet and we'll do what we do jointly and unitedly together. Cabinet um, always agrees. But there is unrest over the issue. The Australian Family Association has written to the Premier and the LNP President warning the government against just tinkering with the law. Such a move would be a political lose-lose. It would break the confidence shown by the groups who supported the LNP's pre-election position. They go further in letters to the huge LNP party room. We support you in challenging the Cabinet-only decision that backflips on the election promise and voter mandate. It's a great day. No comment. I think the decision that's been made is a good balance. Copping some flack in the electorate? No. But one MP broke ranks. My private view is that we should uh, repeal the legislation uh, in the best way that we possibly can. Let's see what they're going to say today, but the government's made a decision. The issue has the Premier pitted against the LNP State President Bruce McIver just weeks before the State Convention. Cathy Border, 10 News.